So it's Christmas morning, and the family has gathered around the tree to, you know, celebrate the true meaning of Christmas, which is open in presents. A nine-year-old boy goes to unwrap his gift, which he thinks has been left by Santa himself. He rips open the wrapping paper, and to his surprise, he's got a PlayStation 4. It's the only item that he has asked for all year long. So you can imagine the excitement this kid must have. And you can also imagine, you know, how delighted the parents must be to see their kid, you know, really excited about a gift that they had purchased for him. So he jumps up. He's shouting, this is the best Christmas ever. Dad, can we set this up now? So his dad goes to set up the PlayStation 4, opens the box. But what he finds inside isn't a PlayStation. Instead, it's a block of wood cut to the exact same size of an actual PlayStation 4. And to add insult to injury, it's not just a normal Woody, but it's got a dick drawn on it and a message that says, from cock and balls with love. And you can probably imagine how crushed this boy must have been. Uh, So his parents said that he went to his room crying, just wanted to be by himself pretty much the rest of the day. And, I mean, what a dick move. You know, pun intended, Uh, because you know this is Christmas, so pretty much every store is closed on Christmas, at least around here they still are, Uh, so you really got to feel for the kid, and of course it would also suck as a parent to have your kid, you know, experience that, but here's a couple of observations to kind of help you avoid this situation in the future. One, if you buy something expensive for somebody, like You know, it could be a console, a tablet, a computer, whatever. Open it up and make sure it works before you give it to them. And that could be for Christmas or your birthday, you know, whatever it is that you're doing. Uh, Especially with consoles, because you and I know that normally consoles have huge updates that end up taking forever to download, so it's not like they can just plug it in and play like the good old days. So set it up. One day while your kids are at school or something, and then put it back in the box, and then that way, one, you know that you don't have a dick in the box, and two, you know that everything is going to work for the big day. So his dad said that they were going to sit down and write a letter to Santa to tell him that he had a naughty elf working for him, which I guess is how he's going to explain this one away. Uh, I mean, the kid's getting on up there in age, nine years old. I don't know how long you normally keep the Santa story going, um... I know whenever I found out that Santa wasn't real or the Easter Bunny wasn't real, I'm like, you know, wait a minute. These are my parents. You rely on them to keep you alive and to feed you legit information. And it's like, well, what else are they lying about? I mean, they made up a story about some stranger flying into our house to drop off gifts once a year. And I always wondered why he only had to come once a year if he's so kind and generous. But anyway, as far as the what happened with the kid, it sounds like it all worked out in the end because the parents had purchased the PlayStation from Target. They took it back to Target. Target gave them another PlayStation 4 bundle along with an extra game plus a $100 gift card. So it, at least it seems that this couple was done right. Uh, and they said that the people at Target said <laughs> this happens sometimes. Like... Yeah, I mean, sometimes you just open up a box and there's a dick inside. It's just one of those things. Uh, so, I mean, this this could have happened at a warehouse or happened with the stocking crew at the store or, I mean, even a customer, uh, maybe a customer service rep who wasn't checking the contents of a return package. Who knows? Uh, but uh, anyway, as far as, you know, a, a customer goes, I got to thinking about that, though. Usually they have those locked away, so I don't know. But a few places where this could have been swapped out, Uh, But either way, the people responsible for this definitely deserved coal this year. And hopefully the kid does enjoy his PlayStation 4 and get some quality playtime with his parents. If you want to read more about it, links down in the description box. That does it for me, The Red Dragon. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Are you listening? Damn.